Shreveport City Council hears from retired employees and a major hospital system over changes to their health care. The Retired Firefighters Association addressed the council during today's work session, including former chief Scott Wolverton. They're opposing changes to their insurance plans that were proposed by the Health Care Trust Fund Board, which affects their coverage with Willis Knighton Hospitals. That was left out of the contract, saying current employees would have to pay more to keep their doctors while retired employees would lose their doctors. Wolverton asked the council to reconsider approving this current contract, saying more than 60% of employees received their care from Willis Knighton. These retirees have served and they've answered the call every time they've been requested. Many being exposed to hazards today that are considered by law to be occupational diseases. They have earned the ability to be able to choose their health care without having to give up their continuity of care with their Willis Knighton doctors and hospitals and keep it without creating a more of a financial burden on them. The president and CEO of Willis Knighton addressed the council, stating their opposition to the retirement plan for 2023. There was a disagreement between him and the city's CFO, Casey Brown, over whether emails were received about contract negotiations. The city's CAO, Henry Whitehorn, says there will be no agreement to lower costs until after a meeting is held with stakeholders on September 7th. But the city needs to recalculate its health care costs no matter what. City council will discuss this further during the regular meeting tomorrow.